Okay, in this question, we're asked to use the technique of the substitution. We're supposed to let x is equal to tan u to show that the following integral is this. Firstly, get some easy marks out of those a by changing your limits. If x is equal to 0 in this case, then uh, we would have that 0 is equal to 2 tan u. We would therefore be solving tan u is equal to 0. And u is the inverse tan of 0, and if you do that, you get 0. If you now let x be 2, you're solving 2 is equal to 2 tan u, which is the same thing as tan u is 1. So u is the inverse tan of 1, which is pi by 4. Make sure your calculator is in radians, otherwise this won't work. Okay, the next thing is if x was equal to 2 tan u, then let's differentiate dx by du must be 2 sec squared u. So therefore dx as the subject is 2 sec squared u du. Okay, now we're in a position to integrate this and I'm just going to copy that here and bring that down and substitute in u's where x's are etc. So this integral actually turns into the integral between 0 and pi by 4. Now x squared would be this squared which would be 4 tan squared u over x squared plus 4 so 4 tan squared u plus 4 and in instead of dx we're going to write 2 sec squared u du. Okay right now just uh, taking a moment here before we just try and launch in and do anything silly. We can. There's a four here on the top. You can factorize a four on the bottom, and the two. We can take that two out here, and we'd actually just have sec squared u du. Okay. Now let's keep going. Those fours can clearly cancel. Now. There is an identity you should know at this point. You should know, because you know that sine squared x plus cos squared x is 1, and if you divide everything through by, sine, uh, by cos squared, you get tan squared x plus 1 is equal to sec squared x. So, I can replace tan squared u plus 1 by sec squared u. So this is 2, the integral between 0 and pi by 4, of tan squared u over sec squared u and this sec squared u here du. Now clearly the sec squared u's cancel and so what we've got we've got 2 the integral between 0 and pi by 4 of tan squared u du. Now do we know the integral of tan squared u? Is it one of the ones we need to know? No it isn't. Okay? Is it in the formula booklet? Again, no, it isn't. But again, this is supposed to be a trig identity because tan squared x is sec squared minus 1 using what we've written here. Tan squared of x must be sec squared x subtract 1. So keep the 2 there and the integral between 0 and pi by 4 sec squared x subtract 1 with respect to x. Now, magically, we can integrate this thing. In the formula booklet, we have the integral of sec squared, which is tan x. And the integral of negative 1 is negative x. And that's between 0 and pi by 4. Keep the 2 there. Substitute in pi by 4, and you get 1. Subtract pi by 4. Substitute in 0, and you get 0. So this turns out to be um, the same thing as... 2 subtract pi over 2 and in the um, answer we're asked to factorise out a half. If I factorise out a half, dividing by half, that would be 4 and that would simply be pi. So it's a half, 4 subtract pi, which is what we were looking for in the question and we're done.